One third of all crashes is one of these, a rear ender. This morning, the government will announce it hopes to cut those accidents dramatically with new technology. It's called auto braking. All right, I'm gonna play the distracted driver. Something we tried on a test track. And so I'm getting really close to this obstacle and it just takes over everything. At least 10 car makers have committed to make auto braking with its cameras and sensors standard equipment on nearly all cars in six years. In fact, some are already advertising their systems. Auto emergency braking with pedestrian detection. The Insurance Institute says that auto braking on all vehicles could cut rear end collisions by 40% and front end crashes by 23%. This morning, car makers will agree that by 2022, they'll make auto braking standard on car and midsize SUVs and on large SUVs and pickups by 2025. The head of auto safety for the government says it could be a game changer. 94% of the time, humans are the problem. That's where the technology is so exciting. The technology could save their life and the people around them. The government and car makers agreeing to this, a deal avoids the long federal rulemaking process. Now, this could add a little bit of cost to a car that you buy six years down the road and beyond. But George and Robin, think about it. This is another one of those systems being added to cars that's getting us a step closer to those autonomous drivers. Exactly. <laughs> I knew that's where you were leaving. People are going to forget how to drive. Yeah, that's it. David, thanks very much.